Uh, that that one hurt. Um, you know, again, we were right there. We gave ourselves on the road an opportunity against the world champs. Um, we let the game slip away. That one possession when they got four offensive rebounds, it, it didn't, you know, win or lose the game for us. It didn't lose the game for us, I should say. You know, we got to come up with the rebound, but we had an opportunity, so we got to get ready to go back home and, and just think about game three. Jason, Darren didn't score any points tonight. I mean, just how tough is it for you guys to win when he can't put the ball in the basket like he did tonight? Yeah, I thought he had some great looks. Um, you know, some went, you know, just were around the uh, rim, you know. But the other thing I thought he did well is he set the tone. You know, he's attacking, getting the ball in the paint. You know, he has seven rebounds and six assists. So, you know, um, you know, we look for him to bounce back in game three um, with making shots. But I thought he, overall game, he was really good. Can you talk a little bit about the boost that uh, uh, Teltovic gave you in the second? I think five of six from three, and uh, ends and ends with a game high twenty. Yeah, I thought our bench was good. You know, with Mirza and, and Marcus uh, coming off the bench for us, uh, giving us an offensive spark. Uh, again, uh, Miami went small, and uh, you know we had a, another opportunity where we gave up two threes back to back. That you know kind of you know took the lead from two. And they, and they grew the lead. So we got to find a way, um, you know, when they go on those spurts to uh, try to interrupt, you know, those spurts where they're not getting, you know, six points to our zero. Um, and that was the mini run that I thought, you know, kind of helped them get the win tonight. Jason, how much did, over here, how much has is, is, uh, Ray Allen sort of impacted this series through the first two games? Did you anticipate him having that kind of impact with all the attention you have to focus on LeBron and Dwayne and Chris? Well, uh, Ray's, if not, you can consider him uh, one of the best shooters in the game of all time with Reggie. You know, you you look at those two players and what they've done, but you, know, you never can count out Ray. He's a competitor. Um, again, he was, I think, Quiet, you know, there into that second half where he got going with the pin down three and and kind of got their mini run going. But Ray's a competitor. He's a world champ. Uh, he, he enjoys this stage. He knows what it's all about. And the first two games, he's been big for him.